So guys, I am back with another Lords of the Fallen video and today guys, I bring you the latest in the way of the bucket, a brand new questline that has hit the game as of right now along with a brand new update too. Let's go. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe okay so they recently just dropped out these patch notes along with details on the way of the bucket which is a new quest line that's been added into the game so let's go through what they have stated okay so this is live on all platforms greetings lamp bearers the way of the bucket an ancient martial art an extraordinary time on ritual or just one man's unprecedented commitment to the humble receptacle Today's update released ahead of our usual cadence answers this question and more with headline features including new questline event the way of the bucket new spouse pack for prevention when attacking improve matchmaking and umbral ending fix okay so the way of the bucket let's start with what they state similar to our halloween event season of the bleak today's update brings with it the way of the bucket, a new and mysterious quest line which upon completion grants a reward of truly indeterminate value. Seek guidance in the words below, which you're seeing on the screen guys, which is probably no doubt a clue into how this quest line is probably progressed, started or somewhere along those lines. Okay, so now we move on to new spells. Embrace the array of new spells now accessible across the three magical schools. You have the opportunity to acquire them by defeating their wielders. The Vortex of Torment uh, summon a Radiant Cyclone which inflicts physical damage and bleed buildup. The Tolling unleash a wave of Radiant Magic which inflicts holy damage and is capable of knocking down enemies. The Blistering Salvo unleash a volley of infernal darts which inflict physical damage and burn buildup. Rising Fire summons several orbs of fire which explode following a short delay inflicting fire damage and ignite buildup. Pallid Bio unleash a torment of umbral magic inflicting wither damage and poison buildup and septic heave held several putrid orbs which inflict physical damage and poison buildup. Please note that these spells will not count towards the Radiant Inferno or Umbral Adept achievement. Pretty cool guys. Ok so core gameplay improvement. With this patch you'll begin an attack animation away from a ledge. You will no longer fall off it if the attack animation draws you to the edge of said platform. However, if you start the attack animation when already standing at the edge, you will fall. Improved matchmaking. We've updated the matchmaking selection process, giving priority to ping while also performing additional checks on the connection at both ends. This may slightly increase matchmaking time, but it ensures a much higher quality connection. Pretty cool. Okay, so umbral ending. For players who previously encountered an issue with the umbral ending, preventing them from completing the game, we have more positive news this week. We've implemented an additional check to address another edge case, allowing you to proceed after being blocked. So now, when you load the game, you should be able to directly access the ending. Okay, so pretty cool. Auto save stuttering. We know that some players are experiencing stuttering when a game auto saves during the latter areas. Please note that we are working hard to resolve this and should have a fix soon. Xbox offset HUD ongoing. We're aware that the HUD display on the Xbox is currently offset and are currently working on a fix. We greatly appreciate your patience in this matter and hope to have an update shortly. Please stay tuned for now. Now on screen now guys you've seen performance, uh, fixes, changes, this and the other, AI, collisions as well as visuals. So if you want to pause the video and read through them, be my guest. But I'm going to jump on the game now guys, try and crack this new way of the bucket quest line. Any other details and updates I have on this quest line, I'll bring you right here on my channel. So expect a complete guide on it soon. But there we have it guys. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.